हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ईसी एकेडमी इन दिस लेक्चर लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड रिस्टोरेशन ऑफ इमेज इन प्रेजेंस ऑफ नॉइस ओनली इफ यू से इन प्रेजेंस ऑफ नॉइस ओनली इट इज स्पेशियल फिल्टरिंग in our previous lecture we understood that the degradation image can be given as g of x comma y is equal to h of x comma y convoluted with f of x comma y plus n of x comma y so here h of x comma y is the spatial representation of degradation function if we take the degradation of image is happening only because of the noise at that case we'll write the equation as g of x comma y is equal to f of x comma y plus n of x comma y so we'll not consider this term so if we take the fourier transform of this equation we'll get g of u comma v is equal to f of u comma v plus n of u comma v in case of periodic noise which we discussed in our previous lecture it is possible to eliminate n of u comma v from the spectrum g of u comma v by subtracting n of u comma v with g of u comma v to obtain the original image so if you obtain this term if we take the inverse fourier transform we'll get f of x comma y so subtracting n of u comma v with g of u comma v we can obtain the original image so spatial filtering is the method that is used in the situation when only additive noise is present which means if only noise is added to the image at that case we'll go with the spatial filtering here there are two methods first method is mean filters and the second method is order statistic filters in this video we'll understand mean filters the first type of mean filter is arithmetic mean filter the operation of this filter can be given as f of x comma y is equal to 1 by m cross n summation of g of s comma t here s comma t should belong to s of x y s of x y is set of coordinate in rectangular sub image of window size m cross n which is centered at the point x comma y so the value of restored image f at any point x comma y is simply the arithmetic mean that is computed using the pixels in the region that is defined by s x y the arithmetic mean filter process the average value of corrupted image g of x comma y in the area that is defined by s x y a mean filter simply smoothens the local variations in the image if you apply arithmetic mean filter noise is reduced as a result of blurring so noise is reduced because of blurring the second type of mean filter is geometric mean filter the operation of geometric mean filter can be represented here as f cap of x comma y is equal to here the symbol pi is written this represents multiplication or product so it is the product of g of s comma t to the power of 1 by m cross n here summation represents addition and pi represents product or multiplication here each restored pixel is given by the product of pixels in the sub image window that is raised to the power of 1 by mn the geometric mean filter achieves smoothing similar to mean filter but it tend to lose image details so here the image details will be lost compared to the arithmetic mean filter the third one is harmonic mean filter that can be represented as f cap of x comma y is equal to mn divided by summation of 1 divided by g of s comma t the harmonic mean filter works well for salt noise and it will fail for pepper noise so harmonic mean filter is best suited for salt noise and it will fail for pepper noise it also works well for other type of noise like gaussian noise the fourth type of filter is contra harmonic mean filter this is the representation of contra harmonic mean filter here q represents the order of the filter this filter is well suited for reducing the effect of salt and pepper noise in this above formula 
if q is positive it eliminates pepper noise and if q value is negative it eliminates the salt noise so it can't reduce both the noise simultaneously so it can't reduce salt and pepper noise at a time either it can eliminate pepper noise or it can eliminate salt noise contra harmonic mean filter will reduce to arithmetic mean filter if we take q value as minus 1 if we make q value as minus 1 this contra harmonic mean filter will act as arithmetic mean filter